What about here? The inspiration, uh, certainly for the sequence of of our gentleman in the Aston Martin DB11, that inspiration came from the Thomas Crown Affair. It's a really lovely contrast because you've got this very gentle you know, room set, and then you go to this, bang, this almost visceral excitement and energy. As a DOP, you, you're looking for the right camera for the right part of the film. For a rig shot, the ME200 is very good because you've got the same lens platform, so that worked with our sort of workflow, if you like. You've just got the box and an EF lens, and then your output is two codex recorders in the boot of the Aston Martin. My name's Kenny Upperfold. I'm a key grip. It's my game, rigging trains, cars, planes, boats, submarines, anything. Kenny is a legend, probably the most famous grip in the world, worked on many of the Bond films. For us, good camera is something that's easy to rig. When I was a kid, it'd take four years to lift the camera up. Working at these little Canon cameras, they're easy to rig. We can put them where we like. Probably doing the boys out of work here, but it's, I think they're great. You know, when you consider that it's so small and you can put it just about anywhere, that enabled us to get great footage. Right, let's go, let's go. OK. Okay, just work that now, Tommy. That's enough speed, that's good, that's good, that's good. We're trying to create an aspirational short film that people will look at and my hope is they will think, oh, that's what it feels like to wear those clothes, to be in that car. You are imagining through Tommy what it feels like to be in this DB11. On the rig shots give you that.